Top 20 Junior Web Developer Interview Questions and Answers As a junior developer, practicing how to respond to the following questions can help you perform better in an interview. Additionally, the sample answer to every question can help you make a great impression and demonstrate that you're fit for the job. 1. Why are you interested in this role? The majority of the employers start with this introductory question to determine your enthusiasm and motivation in the role you have applied for. Tell them what sparked your interest in this role and why you applied for this job. Sample answer. My passion to work as a web developer was fueled when I was tasked with editing the HTML of a WordPress blog during my internship. I fell in love with front-end development. Also, being frustrated by the functionality of the company's website made me desire to become a full-stack developer. My love for coding has grown over the years and I have gained enough skills to solve even complex issues in the industry. I believe that working in your company will also give me more challenges to become better in this industry. 2. What are the roles of a junior web developer? The employer asks this question to test whether you are aware of your duties should you be hired for this role. The best strategy for responding to this question is to highlight the responsibilities of a junior web developer. Sample answer. A junior developer supports other developers and engineers on complex projects. Other roles include testing program and debugging all web applications, designing, developing, testing, and deploying web applications, coordinating with other designers and programmers to develop web projects, fixing bugs, troubleshooting, and resolving problems, developing appropriate code structures to solve specific tasks, supporting and assisting in the upkeeping and maintaining websites. In case a system fails, they initiate periodic testing as well as implementing contingency plans, uploading sites onto the server and registering them with different search engines, assuming ownership of code throughout staging, development, testing, and production. 3. What are the qualities that a junior web developer needs to be successful? The hiring team asks this question to know whether you are aware of the qualities you should have to work effectively as a junior web developer. Highlight some of the qualities of a junior web developer as you connect them to the needs of your employer. Sample answer. A skillful junior web developer needs to be a team player and passionate about knowledge. He should also possess strong problem solving, debugging, organizational, and communication skills. 4. What major challenges did you face during your last role? How did you manage them? This question enables your interviewer to find out if you possess problem solving skills. The best strategy of responding to this question is sharing a challenge you encountered and how you handled it. Sample answer. When I was newly employed to work as a junior web developer, the biggest challenge was getting used to testing in tribal knowledge. I was in Pittsburgh and there was only one university that provided a testing class. I enrolled for the class and took a unit testing and it became easy for me to work in that company. 5. Describe your daily routine as a junior web developer? The response you give to this question demonstrates your ability to prioritize work. In your answer, demonstrate that you are highly organized and you have strong time management skills. Sample answer. I begin my day by checking emails and voice messages. Then I report to the senior developer to get tasks for the day. Most of the tasks include meeting clients to discuss their needs, designing their website layouts, and writing codes to program different functions of the site. Sometimes, I write content that is uploaded on the site. 6. Describe briefly about your experience. This question helps the employer to know whether your background relates to the needs of the company. The best strategy of responding to this question is summarizing your previous work history as you align it with the job at hand. Sample answer. I have been a junior web developer for two years now. In the course of these two years, I have gained a lot of skills in helping senior developers brainstorm on how to meet the needs of the customers. This includes creating an action plan to execute the client's needs for a website. I have also been involved in creating coding languages such as CSS, XML, HTML, and JavaScript to design and develop applications depending on the standards of the clients. Additionally, I would collaborate with graphic design and marketing teams to generate branding and web designs materials. Using my knowledge and skills, I will generate code software according to the standards designed by your company, define and deliver web solutions as well as enforcing network security. 7. What kind of strategies and mindset is required for this role? The employer asks this question to determine your attitude towards the role at hand. As you respond to this question, 
Demonstrate that you are eager to perform the work and that you have the right mindset and strategy to perform your duties. Sample answer. Every junior web developer must know how to follow instructions given to them by their senior developers. They need to possess strong website design skills and be attentive to details. Junior web developers must have clear strategies on how to work under pressure in a technical environment. 8. What is the biggest challenge that you foresee in this job? The employer asks this question to know whether you are familiar with the latest trend in this industry. The response you give will demonstrate your ability to deal with any challenge that may occur in the future. To answer this question, highlight some of the challenges that you foresee and showcase how you can manage them. Sample answer. The major challenge facing this industry is the emergence of unreliable web development companies. Most of these companies have unskilled programmers who charge cheaply but offer low-quality work. However, web application development cannot succeed without a skilled workforce. I am up for the challenge though. Before starting to design an application, I seek to understand the product objectives and its feature to produce a good quality product. 9. How do you stay motivated in your work? This question helps the hiring team to know your values and interests while performing your duties. Highlight some of the interests that keep you motivated while working. Sample answer. New challenges motivate me. I take pleasure in getting involved in all stages of the development of a new website. Through this, I gain useful experience that I can transfer to other areas within this industry. Getting to interact with diverse groups of people and flexible schedule keeps me motivated. 10. Describe a time when you failed in this role and the lesson you learned? Your answer to this question helps your employer to know your ability to own mistakes. Share a real situation that you failed in and the lessons you picked from it. Sample answer. When I was new in this career, the senior developer assigned me a task to create a website for one of the company's key clients. The thought that I was a junior developer created self-doubt in me. I lost track of what I was accomplishing since I didn't have confidence in myself. After two days, the senior developer came to check the progress of that work but honestly I had not even begun working on it. He was very frustrated since there was no much time left to deliver the end product. He demanded that I work on it quickly and insisted on quality. Being pushed to the wall, I began designing the website and within three days, I had already developed a website. The senior developer was very impressed by the end product and congratulated me. That incident taught me to have confidence in my work. I have realized that since then, I have developed cool stuff that has benefited many companies. 11. Why do you feel you are the most suited for this role? The interviewer asks this question to find out more about you. This is the time to prove that your personality, traits, skills, experience, and education matches to the need of the company. Sample answer. Besides being a critical thinker, I possess very strong analytical, organizational, and decision-making skills. I hold a bachelor's degree in information science. I have worked for two years as a junior web developer where I have gained experience working with different coding languages such as JSON, AJAX, HTML, and Python jQuery. My solid understanding of website designing and development has made me competent in this field. I am flexible in the workplace. I believe that given a chance, I will make a success of this role. 12. Share with us your greatest achievement. The employer wants to know your most valuable accomplishments. The response you provide will demonstrate insights into who you are and how you approach your work. Sample answer. The greatest achievement is when I designed a website for one of the schools in New York. The school management used this website to market the school. After a few months, the school became very popular and made many new admission. This became also my reference point. Whenever I tell a client that I am the one who designed that school's website, they trust my work and offer me more opportunities. 13. Why do you think Git is advantageous in web development applications? The interviewer may ask this technical question to test your ability to weigh the advantages and disadvantages of using specific resources and tools. The best way to answer this question is by highlighting your ability to make strategic decisions you can provide examples of what you feel are the main pros to the application at hand. Sample answer. The major advantage of Git is that it is a distributed version control system. It is different from other version control systems because it allows you to track the changes you make to files in the system. It also allows you to return to the past changes you may have made in the file. Git system does not require a central server for keeping all versions of the files within a project. 14. How can you improve UI design? 
The response you provide for this question will help the hiring team to get a snapshot of how you prioritize this concept in your design projects. The best strategy of responding to this question is describing your experience as you streamline applications that lead to improved user engagement and experience. Sample answer. I will begin by evaluating the application to check out usage and navigability. I will then focus on generating sequential activities such as following a sequence to shop for goods, place goods in an online cart, and buy goods. I will make the UI design simple and user-friendly by emphasizing end objectives and what users need to do to get there. 15. Are you familiar with continuous integration? Why is it important during development? The interviewer asks this question to find out how you monitor various aspects of software development such as programming and updating code. In your response, showcase your problem-solving and analytical skills by highlighting how you perform tracking and performance metrics in a project. Sample answer. Continuous integration specifically needs code integration into repositories that are shared many times every day in a project. Continuous integration is important because it verifies each code integration that comes about during early detections of runtime bugs, errors, and other potential problems in development. 16. What would you do to improve or change a company's existing CSS framework? The response you provide for this question will demonstrate how you support your organization or team to achieve goals. The best strategy of responding to this question is highlighting your enthusiasm for this role by providing examples of how you can help an organization improve processes. Sample answer. It will depend on the type of CSS being used. For instance, customizing or improving semantic UI can be a bit complex. This is because in most cases semantic UI is not designed proficiently for overriding project variables. If a company is using semantic UI, I would recommend the removal of semantic and replace it with Bootstrap. I find Bootstrap more efficient in that it can provide a more streamlined functionality. It also allows for non-semantic markups and variable overrides. If a company is using semantic UI, I would recommend the removal of semantic and replace it with Bootstrap. I find Bootstrap more efficient in that it can provide a more streamlined functionality. It also allows for non-semantic markups and variable overrides. 17. What does the term long polling mean? The interviewer asks this question to determine how knowledgeable you are in this field. In your response, define the term, long polling, as you connect to the job at hand. Sample answer. Long polling refers to a web application development pattern that is used to emulate information from the server to the customer. When using long polling, the customer sends a request to the server. The connection stays intact up to the time the server is ready to send information to the client. The connection will remain open until the data gets sent back to the client or when a connection timeout take place. 18. Tell me several ways of how you can reduce page load time. Here, the interviewer is checking how you perform the job. To answer this question, list several ways of reducing page load time concerning the job. Sample answer. Some of the ways you can reduce the page load time include reducing the image size, removing unnecessary widgets, reducing lookups, minimizing redirects, caching, HTTP compression, and placing the script at the bottom, external files or placing CSS at the top. 19. Explain how you would prevent an event bubbling in a software application. The employer may ask this question to assess your skills in solving a problem as well as your ability to analyze perspectives of a situation to find out the solution. In your response, showcase your ability to think critically while looking for causation and applying solutions that achieve positive results. Sample answer. I am well aware that event bubbling makes parent and child event elements to trigger in an application. I would attempt to stop this by using a stop event propagation command available in the programming. If this does not respond to keeping the handler of the parent elements from activating, I would consider using the event cancel bubble command to try disabling triggering of application elements. 20. According to you, what is the correct way to include JavaScript into your HTML? The interviewer asks this question to gauge your technical knowledge about JavaScript. Keep your answer brief but be precise. Sample answer. In my view, the best way to include JavaScript into HTML is by using inline code or inline event handlers. Conclusion. Other than mastering these questions and answers, you need to be bold and confident before the interview panel. That way, you can easily impress your interviewer and maximize the chances of getting hired.